Well, good morning, guys. Uh, so, got a big pond here full of open water. Uh, I've never fished this before. I'm like two and a half hours from home. Uh, my wife had some work meetings, like a conference thing that she had to go to, and she had to get a hotel for a couple nights. So I was like, screw it, I'll go with. So I'm out here. Uh, don't really know anything about this spot. The only rod that I have with me is my uh, Bass Pro Shops brand Ultralight, and I've got a little blade bait tied on there, a little chartreuse blade bait, and that's all I'm gonna do. Uh, I'm gonna try for a little while. I don't have a whole ton of confidence here, once again, because it's never I've never fished it, but uh, it's also early season. Uh, we just lost all of our ice, and uh, it's gonna be windy today. I don't know how much longer I've got before the wind really picks up. It's already starting to get breezy, but they're talking sustained 20 to 30 mile per hour winds this afternoon and gusts up to 40. So who knows? I'm just gonna get to casting, so stay tuned. We'll see if we can catch something. They cast right on that dock. I did, man. I suck. I probably just lost that blade bait. No, nope. surprisingly, I didn't. <laughs> I feel like I don't know what I'm doing when I get these open water rods out after ice season. Doesn't look terrible in the water. Figured I'd give this guy a shot. I don't know why he even bought it. It's been in my box for a while now. Maybe I should be throwing stuff for trout. <clears throat> I don't know how deep this thing is at all. How deep this lake is. There was a fish right there. Just ate off the surface. What the hell? Literally just had a fish bust on the surface right next to me. Right next to me. There we go. I got one. What is it? First fish of the 2020 season. It's a big trout. Big old rainbow. Boy. That's probably the biggest rainbow I've ever seen. Huh. I was not at all prepared for that, guys. That is a big rainbow. That is a big rainbow. I need to get this bag off. Get my pliers out, man. What the hell? That's crazy, dude. I had no idea there was gonna be trout in here. And I sure as shit didn't expect to catch one that big. I could take that back and cook it up for supper if I had something to cook with, but I do not. I wish I had a net to get my hands, because he's gonna be a pain in the ass to try to handle. I'm just gonna try to let him go. Yeah, I'm just gonna try to let him go right away. I don't really wanna screw with him too much. I'll get you a decent look at them though. That is a nice big rainbow. That is easily the biggest rainbow I've caught. And that's my first open water fish of the season. He actually cut my hand open on. I hooked the shit out of him though. There we go. Hook out. Amateur hour. There we go, he's out of here. Right there. Get out of here, bud. There he goes. Huh. Well, that was crazy. What is even going on here? He hammered that thing too. Well, I caught a fish. <laughs> that was easily the biggest 
rainbow I've ever caught. Should have got a picture of him, but man, I don't even know what the hell he did to my line here. I'm just gonna cut that off and start over. That was crazy. That was crazy. Should have got a picture with him, but he jacked this thing all up. Well, I caught a trout on a blade bait. Those guys are probably watching me like, that guy has no idea what he's doing. They're pretty much correct. I wonder if that was the one that it, uh, came flying through that I saw jump out of the water right here. Probably was. All right, we're gonna get this tie back on. Try all this nonsense again. That was a big rainbow, dude. I'm pretty happy with that. I don't really like to handle them unless I'm gonna keep them. Cause they're pretty sensitive to the touch. Their slime coat is. And they are just angry little assholes 90% of the time. They just casted basically straight across the, uh, the little inlet to this pond over here. And you hit it kind of right out in the middle. So we'll try it again. Man, he hammered that thing. I can't believe that. I think I got another one. Or did he come off? He came off. I think I might have had a hit there. Man, that wind's really starting to pick up. Is already crazy. Looks as though somebody wasn't a fan of the security camera. There's no way it could even see anything. It's pointed into the cover there. Well guys, it is windy out here. Um, but I hope you enjoyed the video. I'm still up on the observation tower here. That little pond down there, right there's where I caught the trout. 
and right over here I caught that little bass and uh, I'm up on the observation deck and the main lake is over here it actually looks like it's there's like a shallower spot up there that I should try to fish but man the wind is already just howling I'm glad I have a mic cover on there but uh, I'm gonna get out of here I hope you guys enjoyed this little early morning uh, it wasn't too early I hope you guys enjoyed enjoyed the first open water catches of 2020 um a trout was surprising it was surprising to catch a trout as my first open water fish uh, of the year but hey that was probably the biggest rainbow that i've ever caught i should have uh handled him a bit and gotten some pictures but i don't like handling trout all that much like i said unless i plan to keep them but uh yeah it was surprising and the little bass was nice too um, but I've got some other stuff I want to check out and go do this afternoon. So I guess stay tuned for the next episode. Uh, we'll have a little bit more content from this part of the state. So stay tuned. I'll see you guys in a bit.